It's me, Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. Today we are going to learn about how to crop or chop an image with the help of Python. So how we can do it? First of all, we need to import one or two packages from a specialized library. So our library is PIL library. So we will import from PIL import image and image chops image and image chops okay now these are two modules or sub modules of this main modular library that is PIL how they used to work it's not our concern at this time okay it just simply means that they have some sort of internal functions these are the internal methods or functions and they lie inside this library so in order to use them we have to import them from this specific library now we have to define two variable so we will write image 1 and image 2 okay now image 1 is there and image 2 is there now what, what why we have written image underscore 1 we can write anything instead of this image underscore 1 and image underscore 2 because Python just knows that these are the variables and we can assign any name we can write any name here okay it is not necessary to write image underscore 1 and image underscore 2 you can write any name of your own choice now using this image module that is I am a G E image dot open function we need to open both the images okay image dot open function open is a function that belongs to this sub module image what it used to do image dot open it used to open the image and then store all the image information within image underscore one variable and same is for the second image now how we can import two of our images we have to go to our directory where we have our images so here we have two images one is four and one is five I have made a little bit changes I have made a little changes in the image five like I copied four two times one time and obviously they both are copy of each other but I have made a little bit changes in the image number five so we can we can copy right click on it we can go to properties we can copy this location its name and its extension that is dot jpg now you need to write here this its name is 4 dot jpg okay this is it what's called is the okay this is its path now we need to write this thing okay we, we can double we can write double quote as well if we want okay if you want to write double quotes we can okay and one more thing that you have to uh, double slash all these single slashes so what about 5 for image 5 again we will go to 5 we will go to properties we will copy this thing that is the location of the image 5.jpg okay so okay double slash 5 dot jpg okay now again double quotes also here slash and all this now we have like a we have imported both the images in in our like main program now in order to find the differences between both of these images okay again we will write a variable that is called as the difference okay you can write diff or just d if you want to write just d you can okay so here it is just difference now we will write a function that is called as the image chops image chops dot difference okay okay wait we will make a little bit changes to this variable this is just a variable okay this is just a variable 
you are not supposed to have any concern regarding its spelling okay but what about image jobs you, you should have to take care because it is a built-in function of this library if, if the spelling of this is uh, uh, wrong then uh, the whole program is not going to be executed image chops dot difference image underscore one comma image underscore two okay copy and paste comma image underscore two okay copy and paste okay now it will calculate okay within the within these uh, brackets parentheses we are supposed to give the image uh, variables and by taking the image variables by this function that is difference from image chops uh, module this function will tell us about the difference and then store the difference information inside this difference underscore zero variable and then we can copy it and we can paste this variable and we can write difference dot show and it will show us the difference within an image so now we have to run it out and now you can see that our difference is there our difference is there why it is so because all the image all the images are same all the information in the image is same except this thing which I have made it okay so hopefully you got the concept that how you can find the difference between the two images within the Python so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe